Hey guys! Well, gosh, it's been a while. Um, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys. Um, I hate that saying. Let's find something else. Hello loves and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I have for you a Primark haul. Um, I've been away for two weeks. I've not been in, done any shopping. I did get a Poundland haul, but it was just crisps and tissue. I don't think I got anything interesting from that Poundland haul. I will show it to you after, but it just seemed so pointless filming it. Um, this haul, however, I'm really happy with. So, before I get started, thank you for all my new subscribers. I really do appreciate you uh, subscribing. Um, I do have a few video ideas that I want to film. They're out of the blue. Uh, one to do with my hernia video because I, I still get a lot of people asking questions and I just want to clear some things up and um, help you guys out so yeah uh, when I film them I have no idea because I'm not sleeping very well at the moment it's coming up to the year of my dad's um, death uh, Wednesday and I'm just feeling a little bit the you know just so I went shopping, I treated myself to some bits and bobs, I treated the youngest because I noticed all her stuff is either too short, too small, just she, all the stuff that she has is mostly hand-me-downs, I've probably said this before when I bought her stuff but she always gets the hand-me-down stuff and I, I just feel like sometimes she needs a little bit of a treat, like I do, because the eldest two get clothes all the time but the littlest one just gets handed down. That's the property of a being a, a, the youngest child. Um, so anyway, I bought some tights. Everyone buys these, I think. Um, they're just so good. And, you know, you don't mind paying the £3.50. If one of them gets a ladder, you just like, ah, just throw it away, get new ones. Um, but yeah, they're £3.50. And I bought them in a medium, and they're the, the opaque uh, 40 denier uh, tights. It says with weather sensor finished. I never understood what that meant. I, I still don't know what that means. If anyone can explain the weather sensor thing, please, please let me know. Because I, I do not. <laughs> um, these were still in like the, the pink valentine section in the underwear. But these socks, okay, I said I wasn't going to buy any more socks. Uh, but I have problems, okay? You know this. You know I have issues with, with socks and stuff like that, so... I'm sorry, okay, I'm sorry, but £3.50, they're just normal crew socks, I'm going to rip these open now, because the pattern is just so flipping cute, I'm just going to try not to um, damage the socks, oh crud, so the, the, the back ones are just, oh no they're not, <gasps> ah it says love, and they got like, oh my goodness, look at that little detail, hello, that's cute, um, the second pair, is this the hearts and these ones are just lovely look at those they look like the jumper I made they actually look really nice with this top this is the Primark top from the last Primark haul by the way the crop I love it I've worn it three times already so it was worth the sale price um oh sorry that's my kids screeching it is Sunday today so again filming with the kids home probably not a good idea I bought an umbrella it's pink I have, um, I've always loved pink, but for some reason now the shops are selling pink, you know, like, where did this come from? Like, what, what happened to the world where everything is now pink? It's like they listen to me, because I always used to say, I love my black clothing, but I prefer pink, and now everything's pink, so... I have a pink umbrella, and it's got a cute handle, which I might crochet. Give me a second, guys. My kids... Hello. Anyway, anyway, um, I don't even remember what I was saying. Socks? Socks. Um, what else is in here? Oh, look. guys, I spent £100. Sorry. £99 ATP. <laughs> oh, I bought a lip gloss. I forgot about this. So this is a high gloss. Um lip gloss it's kind of shiny it's like a pearlescent sort of uh lip gloss i have some on so i don't think this is gonna show if i was to try it on but this was one pound fifty for a lip gloss one quid fifty 
Ooh, happy days. Um, I got some earrings. I'll do those in a second. I've got some stuff for the kid, as you know. Um, oh yeah, I was talking about my umbrella <laughs> and everything being pink. Um, I got some earrings. Got some just basic studs. Uh, she kept saying she wants to put her earrings back in. These were only two pounds, and I thought these are quite dainty. She can wear these to school, and I can steal the uh, stars here. I love these and lightning bolts, obviously, because of Harry Potter. But yeah, two pounds, and there's what? How many pairs? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve pairs. Um, I could have counted that from like three across. Uh, I got her some leg uh, joggers, so these were only £4 from £7, as you can see, and they're just the stitch uh, joggers, the Lilo and Stitch, so he's got a little stitch down the bottom there, and it was just the colour, the colour is gorgeous, so I just thought, oh, you know, perfect, I love this colour, she'd look gorgeous in this colour, so I just thought £4, not too bad, considering they're Disney and they was in the sale. Um, these leggings, I bought her, all her stuff in an 8 to 9 because she's so, her legs are so long. Um, but she's really short still. So she's just got really long legs and they seem to be growing faster than everything else. So I bought her these. These are um, full length leggings, pack of two for £6. So it comes in this gorgeous um, tie dye print and the lilac, plain lilac. So... Yeah, I thought they were really nice. And just basics for when she's out and about on the weekends and stuff. Because we realised last weekend we went to the museum on the Sunday. And she had no clothes. She had nothing to put on. It was I felt so sorry for her. Um, also got her pair of normal joggers, £4, in this gorgeous pink colour. Gorgeous, gorgeous pink colour. Working drawstring as well, which we always love. Um, but yeah... Hopefully she'll... I don't know if I bought her any tops. Did I buy her a top? Probably. Ah, I did. Only one. But it was just so cute. And it goes with every, sing, every item I bought her. It's just this outline butterfly top. It's gorgeous. And it was... Uh, I think these ones were £2.30. Uh, they were all in the same section. But only some of the butterflies have like a sparkle on them. You see? I think it's the pink ones that have sparkle and the rest are just printed. But I just thought that was really pretty. And like I said, it matches everything I bought her. So she doesn't really need anything else. Um, oh, also got her this uh, swimwear set. So we don't go swimming. I'm, I don't know why I don't take them swimming. I don't like water. Uh, it's my biggest fear is deep water and water in my face like I can wash my face but being submerged in water scares the living crap out of me um from trauma when I was younger I thought I was going to drown and my brother was playing and yeah it was horrible so there's a lot of people I know that have had trauma in water and now don't like the sea and pools but we always have like a paddling pool on our balcony during the summer and we do have water fights and stuff and um, like I said the eldest two do swimming at school she does not so I bought her this gorgeous set look at this fabric holy hell it looks like it's holographic but it's not it's just a print but the print itself is gorgeous um, it's a racer back top and then the pants um, are just a basic pant but I just, I couldn't resist it. I see it and it was only four, was it four pounds? Yeah, four quid. And I was just like, if that was in my size, I would have probably bought it and worn it for pole. I mean, it's, it's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. That print is just, ah! Um, what else did I get for her? I'll show you all her stuff first. Trainers. So she wanted these. Not sure why. I think she wanted them for school. I bought them in a one. They were only £9.50. Okay. Um, and they're just the fabric trainers with the lace up. She's the only one that can do her laces. Now, the other two, she's seven. The boy is eight, nearly nine. And my daughter is nearly 11. And she is the only one that can do her laces. The other two just don't look, they don't want to learn. So it's just really frustrating. So we have to buy them Velcro trainers still or do the laces up and just tuck them in so they never have to undo them. Nightmare. But um, yeah, they've got this pink speckle in the sole 
and they're just um yeah pink and black laces i really like these and i hope they've got memory foam as well so hopefully they're comfortable for a little while longer um me now me 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 so i see this dress in the window and it had a shirt on with it i wanted the shirt and they didn't have it in my size they only had a 14 to 16 and i just i love oversized but that was just too oversized um 12 to 14 would have been better but i i found this dress it's gorgeous i love this neckline i love the ruching on the boob and it was eight pounds i bought it in a 12 to 14 just because i didn't want the middle being too the waist being too tight um because it starts to pucker the fabric and i didn't want that so i bought it in a 12 to 14 i am worried that the top is going to be too baggy because i don't really have i have boo oops sorry i have boobs but i don't have enough to fill things because my boobs are now you know breastfed boobs they're, they're a bit you know they're not as full at, at the top as they used to be so yeah we'll see how this works but i like this dress so much i bought it in blue <laughs> so this is literally just a throw on dress i can wear this with a cardigan or a shirt like it's like it had a little jacket or something but it's just a basic dress and it's perfect for summer i can just throw it on um throw on something over the top or not and just go but i just love this color as well the color is so pretty so yeah i bought both of those look how cute they are it's just this bust line i love i love ruching on the bust it does emphasize and yeah i'm not still not um you know my love handles are going to show in this but i'm trying not to care as much like you know some some pulling pants and i'm i'm away or my cycling shorts underneath so yeah i'm i'm fine with that this is the other outfit i went in for okay this was in the window and she had the model model the mannequin had on a denim jacket with it now i have not had a denim jacket since i was a kid um and i kept saying i kept saying to myself i don't need another jacket i don't need another jacket but now I'm home and I see this shirt dress and I think to myself, I really could have done with that denim jacket. So I might go back and buy it. It was £17, I think. So it is a bit more expensive, you know, but this was £12. Uh, sorry, this, this was £14 and I bought it in a size 12. It's just a shirt dress, but it's flared at the bottom. It's just so cute. It's so cute. It reminds me, the pattern... It's very 70s, I feel. Like, this would look really good with, like, uh, white PVC, like, chunky boots or something. I don't know. But it's got a self-belt. But I'm thinking, um, like, a chain belt or something to make it more sort of old school. But the flare is what I went for. You know I love a uh, A-line flared skirt. And I just love this. The pattern, the colour... The, the lightness of it as well, it's, it's almost see-through. Like, I can literally see through it. But um, in the summer, because it is long-sleeved, it's not going to bother me so much. And it's elasticated around the sleeve as well, which I think is gorgeous. But this shirt dress, oh, my God. I see it in the window for five days straight. Literally, as I was taking the kids to school all last week, I kept saying, I'm going to pop it to Primark. I'm going to pop it to Primark. Never did. Um, then me and my mum went shopping yesterday and I was like, do you know what? This is my opportunity to buy this shirt dress. It's lovely. Really, really lovely. I can't wait to wear it. Oh, So um, I'm not going to do a try on haul today, but if you look out on my Instagram, every time I put a new outfit on, I'll take a picture and I'll put it up on my Insta. And that way you can see how I've styled the outfit because the handbags, guys, as well. I said I weren't going to buy any handbags yesterday and I see four that I wanted. I don't need handbags. I've got so much crap in my house, in my room. I don't need any more handbags, but it was heart shaped and it was white and it was quilted and it had gold accents. And I was just like, oh my God, I don't need any more handbags. Anyhow, I bought myself, this was also again, Valentine's section. This shit should have gone down, right? Right? Because it's Valentine's. It's no longer Valentine's, but this was 10 pounds. Bought in a medium. 12, 14. Um, and it's just cute night dress, night shirt, night t shirt. I don't know. You can wear this. Oh, sorry. Sorry, it's the sailor mouth in me. Um, I'm going to beat that out at some point. 
uh yeah i would wear this out with shorts underneath or even not just trainers <laughs> done it's the cutest thing ever and it's got all the um love heart uh sayings on it i love it 10 pounds absolutely love it and the fact that it's pink oh god yes so they have the bed set in this as well as in like the top and the shorts but i decided to go with a t-shirt because oversized t-shirts oh they're lovely right comfy cozy you could put on your your knee-high socks with it get all like cozy under the covers even in the winter love it um okay last three items i bought oh hello uh okay so i bought some stockings so i bought them in a large because my fires are i might be a 12 sometimes even a 10 around my waist and my boobs but my thighs are a little bit fuller than the rest of my body i've got wibbly wobbly thighs and i i like my my legs now i've learned to love them you know um but yeah i bought the two pairs of gloss hold-ups in the 10 denier i'm gonna have to cut my nails before i put these on um but sometimes you just want to put on a nice outfit like me and james don't go on dates regularly but um you know when you just want to dress up and feel really sexy even if you're doing it for yourself it's nice to have decent underwear and hosiery and stuff so i just treated myself these were four pound fifty for two so not too bad i can't see where i'm putting the price anyway uh, the last two items i got were these shorts guess what section these were in the men's so we picked up shorts downstairs because i love um joggers now like i've learned to love and embrace joggers jogger shorts for summer even better great i bought some last year they were really really nice i picked up some for this time seven pounds okay in the women's section they had pockets at the front uh pockets at the side lovely thin as anything oh my god they were so thin and i was just like hold on a minute i can why are these so flimsy go up to the menswear now these are thick they have deep pockets they have a working drawstring what the f guys and look at the price hold on hold on two pound cheaper hello what is going on with the world why is menswear better than womenswear but you know what it's got a back pocket too holy hell anyway i'm not gonna discuss about the the wasset because we can wear women's clothes we can wear men's clothes men can wear women's clothes men can wear men's clothes my daughter prefers menswear because the fit and the style of the clothing and the quality is so much better so anyway i bought these in the pink in the medium and then i bought these for home because i probably wouldn't wear these ones out in the large because they're a little bit too big but they are drawstring but they're the same quality Hello, peekaboo. Um, they're the same quality as the other ones. But our ones downstairs were so flimsy and thin and horrible. And I was just like, look, these are flipping fleece lined. What the hell? Anyway, that was the end of my haul, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, I'm really excited. I have new clothes. Again, new clothes I don't need. But, you know, anyway. Um, thank you for watching, guys. And make sure that you look in that mirror today and tell yourself you are beautiful, you're amazing, and you are loved, okay? Um, I need to do that too. So yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. Take care of yourselves, happy shopping, and I'll see you in my next video. Not sure when, but, you know, that's me. Um, woo. Love you. Bye. <laughs>